Hey guys, welcome back. So today I wanted to do a quick little video on um, the website Zaful, Z-A-F-U-L, and I'll put the name here and I'll link it down below. I've gotten a ton of questions on this lately on my Instagram. I posted a couple of pictures in bathing suits and everybody wanted to know what I thought of them, what the sizes ran, so I thought I would just get on here and do a video to kind of give you guys uh, a more in-depth look. And I'm going to insert pictures of myself wearing uh, the bathing suits too so you can kind of gauge, you know, on that. Now, um, I think one of them is in the wash, so I'm going to insert pictures so you can see them, but I'm just going to hold up what I have here. So, okay, so basically, I found this website on Instagram. They have a huge following on Instagram. They are a company based out of, I believe, they're Hong Kong or China, which I didn't know at the time. And um, they have great pictures on Instagram. They really do. So I wanted to get some bathing suits and some cheap ones. I was going on other websites, and, you know, it's like, nowadays it's like, I don't know, 30 to 40 bucks for one bathing suit, whether it be at TJ Maxx or ASOS or uh, Victoria's Secret. I mean, bathing suits are expensive. So when I was browsing this website, the one thing that really got my attention was that they were like, there were like a billion styles. I mean, you really couldn't go wrong. There were so many different kinds of bathing suits on there and they were cheap. They were like $9, $10, $8. I'm like, are you kidding me? And it came with the top and bottom and they looked, the pictures on Instagram looked so good. So I was like, this is probably too good to be true. So um, I got them and I tried them all on and I did love them. They do look amazing on. So let's just get started one thing at a time. This is the cover up that I got and um, it's very lightweight. It's see through, it covers just your butt. This is not something you're gonna wear like as a dress or anything. Um, what I do, it's, it's very, the material for all of these things is very delicate, guys. Remember that. I mean, it's, will snag easily. Probably need to be very careful through the wash with any of this stuff. Like, I'm going to wash this now because I've been living in bathing suits and cover-ups. So, um, you know, with sunblock and sweating and it's been so hot, I do want to wash them, but I wouldn't suggest drying. Bathing suits, some of them I'm going to tell you, I would suggest just hand washing. But really do like that cover-up. A lot of their things are one size fits all and that fits nicely. It's off the shoulder, it's really sexy, it's really easy to throw on. Again, you'll probably need jeans under it, jean shorts or something. It's even cute to wear with like a cute bralette and like maybe leggings and just wear it as a shirt, like a top. So I think their clothing would be a really good bet too and they do have some clothes on the website. I did not purchase any, just the cover up. So um, first of all, I'll talk to you guys about the seashell bikini bathing suit. So I really, really liked this. I purchased this and it's kind of like the cups kind of look like seashells this fit perfectly the top all these bathing suits i'll tell you the size this one was a medium um i was just afraid of the fit like i didn't know where the bathing suits were coming from i didn't want them to be too small and too revealing so um really liked this it was really cute has a tie great a lot of support and this is um which is nice it actually has it's kind of like a push-up and it has bra support in it the bottoms on the other hand. So the bottoms were navy, really cute, kind of like a ruched bikini. First of all, they were humongous. They were humongous. Um, yeah, I tried everything to make it work, but the problem is they're very, very cheeky, as you can tell. So being that they're too big, not only do they not cover, but they don't fit properly. So I'm not gonna send this back to China. It took over two weeks to get my shipment in. Um, if you guys have any ideas of making bathing suits smaller or what I could do with this fabric, let me know. But it's really cute, and I'll just have to buy a different bottom. I even like the navy with that white. Um, but unfortunately, this is the only one that really just didn't work for me. Um, yeah. So the next one I want to talk to you about is one that I've been getting a lot of comments on. It is a crochet bikini. These are one size fits all. It's the white one. And this is the bottoms. So these ones actually are not cheeky at all, believe it or not. These ones fit really, really well. I was a little worried about the top because first of all, it looked small, um, but it fits perfectly well. And there is no support, you guys. It is totally crochet. What you see is what you get. That is it. There's no like padding. There's no cups in here. There's nothing. So I was like, is this going to be see-through? Ironically, it's not. Um, at all, like you, can, you can't see my, really my nail polish or anything through here, maybe you can, I don't know, but it, it wasn't when I tried it on, 
and I'm inserting pictures and stuff like that around here I know so you can see it actually on but I have not at all felt like it was um, too revealing or whatever what is this but um, this is something again very delicate when you wear this in the um, pool the beach wherever you're going it's going to expand okay that is one thing I don't know if you guys know um, because it is crochet hold on it is um, crochet and there is no like structure to it it's just crochet it is going to expand it's going to sag okay so that's one thing Wear it in the pool if you want. If you're going into an ocean but you don't go all the way in, this is a perfect bathing suit for that. It's really cute. It's very trendy, but um, also with washing it, I recommend just hand wash it in your sink or I do it in the tub and just use either some detergent, just a little bit, or even um, antibacterial soap or um, shower gel. Something like that is what I've been using and just hang it to dry, you know, um, because this will ruin in the wash for sure. That is the one thing. These are like literally just the yarn. Um, this one I, I loved and it looks really cute on. I'm gonna, um, this is the back. This one is cheeky but it's not that bad. I thought looking at this I'm like oh heck no and I have a booty. This is not that cheeky. I mean I wouldn't wear it like to a pool party probably. I wouldn't wear it to like um, a lake party where you're gonna be like tubing and stuff. But if you're just going to be laying out um, and you want a little tan, your tan your little booty a little bit more than normal, this is perfect, okay? I love this. I've seen bathing suits with these shells retailing for 100 Now here's the thing. It did expand. It got a lot bigger on me in the water, a lot looser. And these shells are very delicate. When I hand washed it, this part here with all these, this little beading and all these shells, it expanded. It was huge. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's just going to it's never going to shrink back to where it is and I thought the shells were going to start falling off but it didn't it came back together so it's it's really cute I mean if you're going to go on like a girls trip or your honeymoon this is a perfect bikini for that because it's very unique and then this is the top um, really really cute now the only thing with this black I'm going to warn you too I have I wear all natural deodorant and I'm um, starting a new brand called native deodorant and Native is basically in the stick form, like it's like your normal deodorant, the white stick form. It's not like the primal pit paste that you use, um, that you dig out like that. So that, the white deodorant I had got on here and I really had to like scrape it off because it was, first of all, it's black, so it's very noticeable, but this will pick up anything and it just will sit on the crochet. So I just washed this with, um, it smells really good. I washed it with just shower gel and rinsed it out. I mean, I'm not wearing my bathing suits for very long, but I am in chlorine when I am wearing them. And you can tell, like, look at how this is getting bigger and stuff. That's what kind of scares me. They're very delicate. I don't know how many seasons they're going to last, but it looks really cute on and it fits just right. It really does. From looking at the pictures, you guys can tell. I mean, I didn't alter. I didn't even put um, fillers on because I didn't have to. They, they looked that good. This was a very popular one. I just thought it was really cute. It is a pineapple bikini. This is the one of the most wearable ones that I have. Um, this is the top and then what's great about it, I didn't even know it was reversible. So this is like the inside of you know the pineapple. I thought that was really really cute and inventive and either way you wear it it looks good. So like you either wear it like this, right? Cute, okay. Or you can turn it like this or wear it half and half, whatever you want. This one is full coverage as you can tell it's not cheeky. I have yet to wear this one in the pool or anything, but I really like it. I think it's so cute. And I tried all these on just to let you know. So this was really cute. And this one was on um, back order. So just be wary when you do order things. Like I had, it took about two weeks for me to get one shipment. And then the back order stuff came like a week later-ish, but pretty quick. So, um, but I really, really do like that. And the next one I think is in my washer actually. And it is the palm tree one. And um, I'm definitely going to insert a clip so you can tell. Now, I love this one. I think it is the print is just in gorgeous and is just as gorgeous in the picture as it is in person. It just has this very it's very vibrant. It's very lifelike. It's not like I don't know prints and some bikinis that are like too much. This is you know what I mean are too busy. This is like they took palm leaves and just took pick took, took a whole bunch of HD pictures and created this bathing suit with it. It is gorgeous. Now, here's the thing. This bathing suit I ordered in a medium. 
The bottoms are kind of very tight. It's not cheeky at all. It's a lot like um, this type of bathing suit. Um, not cheeky at all, but it's very tight, which is weird. Um, because all the other ones were kind of really big. It just felt a little bit off in that tight. But it wasn't uncomfortable to wear. It didn't make me want to send it back. I'm still going to wear it. It's fine. And the top was big. Now, the top, it fits fine. It looks as good in the picture as it does on me. So it doesn't look huge or anything. It was just very odd. The top was just a little bit big. So, you know, once I put it on, it's fine. And that one you can wear it to a party or you can wear out. It's another one that's very, very wearable in public, I guess you could say. So really comfortable. It wasn't, and it's weird. It's not like too big where I can't wear it or anything like those blue bottoms. It's just a little bit of an awkward fit. And I guess that's what happens when you wear bathing suits online. And, you know, just be mindful of that. You just, you never really know. But, um... Just looking at the picture, the bathing suit is gorgeous in person, you guys. These colors, the way that it looks, the way that it fits, I mean, it's just gorgeous. And it's not going to fly off when I jump in the water or anything. It's not that too big, but it is very interesting to fit. So um, I'm glad I did order a medium because I don't know if a small for me would even have worked. But I love the colors. This bathing suit is very unique. It's just, it's beautiful. And then um, last, I just, um, I purchased this one. And it is just nude with these black stripes. I honestly like was not going to purchase one. I'm like, I have a lot of black bathing suits. But I loved it with the nude coloring. And it fit perfect. This is one of the more, I don't want to say skimpy bikinis because it's really not any more skimpier than my other ones. But it is kind of like a, you know, it's got the string ties on the side of it. Um, it's not crazy. It's not cheeky or anything. It's just a very normal bathing suit. It's not like, like this is definitely a cheeky bathing suit here. No, it's, it's more full coverage and everything. Um, but it is like, it's really sexy when you wear it. I don't know how else to say it. It's like, it fits just right. It makes my boobs and I have no boobs. It makes my boobs look great. It fits like, like perfectly. Um, and so I like it. I just feel sexy when I wear it. I feel, I feel like I'm rocking it. So Again, um, everything I ordered was in a medium except for the crochets, which are one size fits all. Uh, you know, you do, guys, be careful because, you know, you you are ordering from a place that's farther away. You can't just send them back. So I would suggest when going on this website and looking for bathing suits that you may want to purchase, I would suggest you look for bathing suits you're most comfortable in. You know, don't order all ones if you're like, oh, I'm not sure. Like, I really was on the website for days looking because I was thinking that same thing. Is this going to be too cheeky? I'm not sure about this. I don't know about this one. So I got kind of a mix, as you could tell. I got some I knew were going to be full coverage and some I knew were going to be a little cheeky. Um, so I don't know if you like any of these bathing suits and that helps you. Uh, I'm not going to be putting pictures of my butt because I know everybody would love to see how cheeky they really are because that's, like, the number one question I'm getting. Um, but I'm just not there yet on YouTube. You know how it is. So... I'm hoping these pictures and this helps a little bit. I'm trying to get to all you guys on Instagram and, and respond as best I can. I know some people were saying, hey, I'm looking for the one in the middle, bottom, corner, whatever, and I can't find it. They do change up their suits very often. So if you can't find like a suit on there, just wait a couple days. Do you know what I mean? Keep browsing. They have ones that are very similar. I mean, they have a ton. They also have some really cute clothes. I would suggest you follow them on Instagram ton of coupon codes. I think actually on their Instagram, they have a coupon code like right up, right up there that you can always use. So, um, I also got like 10% off. So, I mean, they're really cute. They all fit really well. They look great in pictures and, um, I've really been enjoying them. It's fun because I could get a whole bunch of different kinds and try them out. Uh, just, just be wary because again like this one it was it's such a shame because it's really cute but it's way too cheeky first of all and it um when i say cheeky me my butt hangs out on the sides too much um it just doesn't cover enough of my butt put it that way uh and it's just too big so maybe i can try using some fabric glue and just going down here and kind of you know shrinking it up a little bit i don't know um we'll see but and again, like if you're just sitting out by your house and you just go through bathing suits quickly, these I don't mind too because it's like if they only last me a season or two, it's not the end of the world because I'm not spending 40 bucks on them. And I got so tired of buying bathing suits from other places, and you girls probably know what I mean, where the little pads fall out in the wash or they don't survive the wash. I'm in chlorine. I'm sweating all day. I'm in a bathing suit all day long. I need to wash it. I never like, I honestly never, not even on vacation do I wear a bathing suit like, 
multiple times. I really just wear it the one time, especially at the beach, you get sand, whatever. So I don't mind spending it and having bathing suits that, you know, you kind of have to learn the fit, put it that way. Now that I know when I go back on the website, I'll know what ones to buy and what ones I like best and things like that. You kind of learn, but I think it's great. I mean, bathing suits are really hard to come by. They're very expensive. You're getting a great discount here. They always have coupons. They're fun. They're on trend. I mean, they have like any bathing suit that you're thinking, oh, I really want one that looks like this. They have it. They have it. And I like the clothes too. So, um, yeah, my advice is just be careful when you, um, when you order. Really take a look-see. Know your body type. Know what bathing suits you like. Don't order a whole bunch of the same type. You know, spread yourself out like I did to see which ones will fit you best when you get them. And go to town. It's awesome. They have really cute, um, like, two-piece tops and bottoms and stuff on there. Um, like, clothing-wise. Like, a crop top and, like, nice, fully pants. I mean, they have a lot of really cute stuff on there. So, um, I hope this helped. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I answered some of your questions. Leave me a comment below. Any more questions you guys have, I'll try to get to everybody. And um, I'm going to put this up right away so that um, hopefully it kind of helps you guys uh, decide on what size you want to purchase. And again, it's so hard. It's like perfume bathing suits. It's very unique to the individual. So take that for what it is, you know. I wish I had an answer for everybody. But... Um, some sizes I probably should have definitely gotten a small and I didn't live and learn, but you just don't know and I'd rather have them almost be too big than too small. That's my opinion. So if it's way too small, I'm just pleased. You can't do anything about that. So, all right. I will um, talk to you guys later. Uh, thanks for checking in and I hope you have a wonderful night. Bye.